Things you don't realize you need in college, but definitely need. 1. A handheld steamer. You're going to have interviews and important presentations. You can't have wrinkly clothes. 2. Tupperware. I may or may not have relied on this to take food out of the dining halls, but you'll need it. 3. Shoes specifically for going out. Going out completely destroys your shoes. Mine had holes in the bottom by the end of the year. Don't even get me started on the filth those shoes touch. Trust me, you don't want to wear them anywhere else. Like if you want a part 2. Here's some things that you have to bring with you to college. Tide stain remover pens for the moments that get messy. A hammock to put in your dorm or to lay somewhere and study on campus. Trust me, you'll want space saver closet hangers for this and for shoes. It'll keep stuff off your floor. Things you need for college from a rising junior. First, you're going to need a really big mirror because it makes taking your pictures so cute and your outfits will just look so much better. A steamer, you guys need this. It's like 20 bucks on Amazon. Just trust me. You need a big coat because it's freezing walking to class, especially if you live in the Midwest like I do. Um, I think this is things because I'm not organized and I just need to throw stuff somewhere sometimes and that's okay. You also need a hairstylist in your college town because it makes getting your hair done very easy. If you're going to college this fall, listen up. Here's some essentials that you actually need. I'm a well-seasoned college student, so let me help you out. You're gonna need a Swiffer, not a broom, not anything dry, something moist to clean your dorm floor. Dorm floors get so gross, and a broom just doesn't cut it. Another essential, a carpet. I don't know if your room comes carpet, mine did not. And feeling your floor on your bare feet? It was disgusting. A Swiffer and a carpet will serve you well. Three, get all the organizers that you can. Space is low and you need to organize things. Otherwise your room kind of becomes like a pile of just all your stuff and that's not helpful when you're trying to get to class and find something. Let me know if I should make more. Hi, I'm really bored. So here's a list of things that I'm really glad I brought my first year of college because I probably wouldn't have survived without them. First is a phone wallet. Um, you don't have to worry about carrying a lanyard around and you can just like grab your phone if you're ever in an emergency without worrying about your keys. Definitely get one of these or like a bedside table. It's so helpful, especially if you like locked your bed or even like partially locked it. If you can, get a portable charger and just like carry it around with you at all times in case it's an emergency. A wrinkle release spray is a lot easier to bring in an iron. Um, it doesn't work for like all kinds of clothes, but it's great to use. Just make sure you use it the night before so your clothes aren't wet. Buy a doorstop or something to prop open your door and just keep your door open the first week when you're in your dorm. You get to know a lot of the people in your hall and it you can make a lot of friends. Ladies, you already know, unfortunately. Pepper spray, yeah. Get a laundry basket with wheels or backpack straps. Just trust me. School supplies you need for college, part two. Okay, so the first thing, a graphing calculator. If you take pre-calc or calc or like stat or anything, you're gonna need this, so just bring a graphing calculator. Okay, the next thing you're gonna wanna bring is a stapler. And this isn't something I thought of until I got to college and I was like, wait, I don't own a stapler. My one professor actually, every assignment we turned in, she made it mandatory to use a stapler and our lecture was huge and she wouldn't let anybody borrow her stapler. We had to do it on our own, so it's important to bring one. Okay, this next one is huge, but bring a planner. In college, you're in charge of memorizing everything. You don't have your teachers like in high school telling you what to do, so a planner is huge. Okay, and lastly, index cards. I took a speech class where we had to write our presentations on note cards, so they were really good to have. 